Welcome to LearningMall.com. Today we are going to look at different types of FICA coins. Aaron, remember you told me to save my birthday money? Yes. And did you? Yes, I decided that I wanted to save up for something big. Something big? Hmm, like a car? No, silly. A video game console. Good idea. Then I can play it too. But Aaron, remember you said that I had to put my money away in a safe place? Yes. Well, I can't remember where I put it. Oh, James. What will we do with you? You really need to ask Mum to get you a bank account. Good idea. But there's different accounts. Which one should I get? Don't worry, Mum and Dad will help you with that. But I'll explain for you. You are correct. There are two main types of accounts. Current accounts and saving accounts. Savings? That's exactly what I made. Uh, yes, but you may want a current account when you're a little older. Why? What's the difference? Well, saving accounts do exactly what they say. They help you to save. If you put money in these accounts, you will usually earn a higher interest. Which means you'll have even more money than what you put in. That sounds amazing, but what's interest? Well, interest is money that the bank will give you for saving your money with them. The idea is that you leave your money in there for a long time and you save enough to buy what you want. Free money! Well, not really. Banks pay you interest because they use your money for other projects. It's like renting a bike on holiday. If you want to have a bike for two hours, you must pay the owner some money. Banks work in the same way. They will borrow your money for a while and pay you a rental fee or interest. Oh, I never knew that. So, what's the current account then? Well, current accounts are different because they are accounts that you may use to put money in and take it back out often. Most banks won't allow you to open one of these accounts until you are 11, so you might have to wait a while, James. Basically, a current account allows you to put money in, take money out, pay for things in shops and online, and even get an ATM card. An ATM card? That's the card that you can use to take money off a cash machine, isn't it? Yes, exactly. You can also use ATM or debit cards to pay for things, but that's for another day. Okay, so a saving account it is then. Now, I just need to find my money hiding place. Where did... I remember now, I put it in an old smelly sock to stop anyone from stealing it. Oh no, I hope Mum hasn't washed it. Diams, time to get a bank account. Hope you enjoyed learning with us today. Please don't forget to subscribe and give us a like. Why not pop over and visit us at www.learningworld.com